everyone and welcome this is jane from janeliberated.com i am here once again to add value to your life by helping you overcome fear shame resentment and you will never get stuck again in life words are powerful words are powerful be mindful of what you say never made a mistake to pronounce a negative word on yourself on your marriage on your children be careful because words are very powerful whatever you send to the universe is what we bring uh, what the universe will bring back to you be very very vigilant when you want to speak word out be attentive to speak out a positive word positive words will definitely bring you positive energy in life things will happen we live in a world that we can really not stop bad things to happen bad things do, do happen to us bad things happen to people but learning to pronounce a positive word over any situation is what will bring you a positive result in life the book of psalm 64 verse 3 says they sharpen their tongues like sword and aim cruel words like deadly arrows whatever you are confessing is what will come to you I have been in a gathering where I experienced a lot of insults but I was so confused and I really don't know how to respond in a gathering we call Christian gathering where the man of God will come to the altar instead of preaching the word if the word is preached, it's just like 10 minutes. The rest is about gossiping. It's about raining insults on people. It's about insulting people that don't pay tithe. And we call the place a place of gathering. And at the end, when such people don't see results in their lives, they blame it on situation. They blame it on family altars. They blame it on whatever situation that surrounds them that they are seeing right now. Not knowing that the words that have been pronounced on them on that altar has begun to manifest a new result in their life. But I'm here to tell you today, I stand for good news, that no man, of, no man born of a woman will be able to curse you. Why? Because if you have faith in the word of God, if you have faith in the things of God, if you know that Christ lives in you, there is no man that will be able to condemn you. But at the same time, you have a job to do. If you are in such gathering or you find yourself in that situation, learn to return those things and change those curses or those words to a positive one. Claim the promises of God over your life and let God begin to work miraculously in your life. I hope I have succeeded in adding just another value to your life today. Be careful of your words. Be careful how you speak to your children. Be careful how you pronounce things to yourself because whatever you say or whatever you speak out to the universe will surely come back to you. Remember, there is nothing too difficult for God to do. If you are new to my YouTube channel, please do subscribe, like and share this video with your friend. And don't forget, check the links in the description box to take you to my website, my books and everything that I blog about every day are all motivational. But remember, I am your sister in Christ. Love you all. Bye. Hello everyone and welcome. This is Jane from janeliberated.com. I am super excited to announce to you that the Freedom Guide, which is completely free to download, will soon be online. It is all about our freedom. It is all about liberty. When we are not free in life, we are not able to do that which we enjoy doing. Sometimes we hold on to the past for a long time that we are not able to function in our real self. But in this Freedom Guide, I know you are going to benefit from it because it contains points that will help you and to set you free in life i hope you enjoy it and i will be super excited to read your comments concerning the freedom guide have a fantastic day bye for now